you heard a lot about twin charging and it is certainly a good way to get rid of the turbo lag. But it is a complex system, not easy to set up and there is one company which reinvented this idea. A two-stroke diesel engine cannot work as any other naturally aspirated engine. It has no capability to suck air inside as it is fed from ports at the lower part of a cylinder uncovered by a piston at the bottom dead center. The burned mixture is then pushed out through overhead valves operated by a camshaft, at least in case of a two-stroke crosshead uniflow design. Oxygen has to be forced inside the cylinder and to provide a constant flow of fresh oxygen there is a mechanically operated blower. It is usually a root type unit engaged all the time and for that reason every two stroke diesel without a turbocharger is considered naturally aspirated. There is no other more natural aspiration for it. In case of let's say Detroit diesel engines there were naturally aspirated versions, turbocharged and then also after-cooled turbocharged, which means using an intercooler. Electromotive division took it on a next level and instead of mounting two force induction units onto the engine, they merged it together. The fact is that the turbocharged version basically only has the turbo unit. There is no roots blower and the turbo is crankshaft driven, keeping the engine running even at the low range of RPM. There is an overrunning clutch which simply is not in action when the exhaust gases flow is faster than the transmission to the turbo, actually up to 16 to 20,000 of turbine RPM. This also boosts power significantly higher than using a blow only, which normally provides about atmospheric pressure inside the cylinders. This design is unique for the EMD 567 645 and 710 series and besides the fact that you only have a two-in-one device instead of two separate ones there is no power loss in the mechanics for not having to run a redundant supercharger at higher revs although it was the same turbo setup for all those series the naturally aspirated 567 and 645 had the roots blower and the 720 was turbocharged only. EMD says that this design brings up to 50% more power, a significantly low fuel consumption and emissions, and also improved high altitude performance. <laughs> 